work on your posture now because this is what's going to get you across the floor. Slumping over is not going to get you across the floor in a correct, in a correct technique. Just an FYI. Leap, like don't put so much force into like the chasse that you don't put enough force in your plie because the chasse not getting you nowhere well i mean it's getting you traveling across the floor but like the plie is what really gets you up so make sure you put more into the plie than the actual chasse and second don't lean over when you do y'all leaps like make sure y'all pull up and bring your legs to you I'm not a man. 
some feminine products. Okay, so like wipes, deodorant, things like that, just to kind of keep yourself intact. Um, so tomorrow's lineup is kind of similar, except there will be judges here. And so you'll be doing that same kind of rundown with the judges, okay? So it'll begin with um, a stretch, okay? And then it'll go into across the floor. So you'll be in those same lines that you were in today, across the floor, okay? So same lines, you're gonna go across the floor, same combinations. After that, we'll break you up in groups, in smaller groups, and you'll perform the dance for the judges, okay? Uh, nine times out of ten, the table will be this way, so you'll be facing the same way you came going across. You'll probably be facing that way, if not. If, we'll see. We'll see. After that, we make cuts. Okay, so we'll be cutting. After that, you'll learn a second routine, a hip-hop routine. Okay, so you'll learn a hip-hop routine. After that, You'll get further instructions for those who make it that far. And then you go home. Okay? So tomorrow, all black, two piece. Don't come up in here trying to hide. All black, two piece. Hair, makeup. You want to present your best self. Okay? This dance is real. It's, it's kind of groovy, all right? You want to show your personality. That does not mean change the counts or change the movement or do what you want to do, okay? But there's certain parts that allow us to see your personality. So keep that in mind. You want to sell it. You want to sell yourself. You want, to, you want us to not be able to take our, our, our eyes, excuse me, off of you all, okay? Being a hairstylist, let me explain something. You choose to come here tomorrow with a bun, that is all on you. That's great. You feel like that's the best your hair is gonna look. It's not gonna look ate up and chewed up and like you just came through a shit storm. Put your hair in a bun. But just know when you wear a bun, you don't have nothing flying around your face. That means it is all on you. You feel me? If you are wearing your hair down, sew your wig down. If you don't know how to curl your hair, make it bone straight. You don't want to see no frizz. You don't want to see no shaka zulu. None of that. Got you. Also, take the time out to maybe go on YouTube and look at some like basketball dance teams, like Miami Heat dancers. Like, look at that style. Look how they kind of wear their hair. It's not, this is not, you know, tight pin curls. Like, this is not that style. It's like a loose wave. You are grown. We are women. Okay? You want to embody women. Okay? So, you're not in high school anymore. So what you did in high school, leave that shit there. This is a whole other style. Okay, look at some videos. You know, soak in, try and soak in as much of the style as you possibly can. You won't get all of it, but you'll get a little bit. 